Hello, I am Mal, and welcome back to Wasteland 2. Alright, we find ourselves here in Playa del Rey, and it would appear that we're here too late. Everyone seems to be dead, and if I'm not mistaken, someone really wants it to think that it's us. Now... I don't know who would slaughter a village and then put their tags up in blood, but, you know, I, I think that's the intent anyway, is to frame us for it. Okay, these people are dead, so I'm not going to leave their gear laying around. I don't see how that helps anyone, so... Break the stuff down as we go. Okay. Another person. Let's zoom out here. What's up with this big crane? Interesting. Okay. Uh huh. Mana rights. Okay. Well, I mean, it would make sense that they would respond, right? What's up here? Tower? Something? What's up there? Go take a look. Ah, a toaster. Okay, well, then I need Vulture's Cry up there. Seventy-eight percent chance. What do I have her skill at again? Nine toaster repair. Yeah. Okay. Gloves. G three, huh? Well, I'll look at these in more detail later. Let's just grab the stuff. Hmm, too much. Okay. What else is around here? Okay, what's here? Under one of the nearby cars you find the remains of a synthetic arm. It looks like the children of the Citadel who did this. Okay, well, yeah, that's kind of what we thought. What's this thing? Looks like some sort of GPS device. It does not appear to be working, though... It does seem to be powered. Huh. Okay. Computer skill? Carefully open up the machine and study its insides. Most components are functional, but the display and its connections are pretty busted up. It would take some major mechanical know-how to jury rig a fix. with a broken display. You could probably jury rig it. Otherwise you need to find an appropriate part. Wait, whoa, whoa, hold on. Of 
course, I carry everything with me except that stupid display. I know I've got something for that, though. Alright, well, we'll have to come back. Well, I guess I don't know. I'm pretty confident I've got something for that. Yeah. Um, um... I'm pretty confident, I guess is what I would say. She carry more than one? Yep, looks like it. Okay. Oh, Wesley doll. Yep, grabbing that for sure. Another another G3, huh? Okay. I'm glad I cleared out my backpacks before coming here. So these guys are just gonna let me walk around, huh? Okay. Well then, I'll do that. And not interact with him, I guess, until I have to? Or maybe you don't even have to. Oh, yeah, I guess you do. Keep your weapons lowered and identify yourselves. I don't answer to you, unless you want our weapons to speak. Your unwarranted hostility is both boorish and rude. But seeing the... Slaughter you've already caused. I will not risk the lives of further enforcers to teach you manners. The field is yours, gentle butchers. But you're now known to us. Yeah, whatever. Piss off. We didn't do this. I guess I got... Well, I guess I could have gone that option and actually <laughs> tried to explain that. But whatever with him. Bag of cat litter, alright. Who can carry that? Can she carry it? No, like, everyone's overburdened now? Nope, okay, we're good. What's this back here? I guess we can't get to it? I want to know what this thing does. Does it control this crane? I mean, it says it's a G... It says it's a GPS device. Hmm. Okay, I'm really curious about that. Alright, so this place was kind of, uh... Yeah, unfortunate. Let's go, ahead, let's go out of here. And I am going to make a quick cut in the video... Uh, well, let's leave in case Woodson or somebody calls us. Seems like every time we leave an area now, we get a distress call for something or another. So let's leave, see what happens, and then if there's no, like, distress call or anything from Woodson, then I'll make a cut in the video. I'll go back to our base. I'll, like, sell stuff or whatever, re-equip a little bit, get that... Uh, I'm confident I've got a thing for that GPS thing. I'll grab it and come back here. That's the plan. All right, so I'll see you in a second. Echo one, this is Santa Fe Base. Come in. Oh, okay. See, what, every time I leave a place, Woodson's got something to talk about. Yes, Woodson, what is it? Roger, Echo one. Getting a lot of chatter on the Manorite's private frequency. Said they found you at the site with many civilians dead and no hostiles. They seem to think you might have killed the Civ. Yeah, they were dead Copy when we arrived. One. All dead before you got there. Any signs of who did it? Found a synth arm. Fuck us up any way they can. Listen, Echo One, we can't let this happen. We have to find proof of who's really behind these attacks. Something we can show the Manorites. That's priority one from now on. Copy? 10 4, stay safe. Yeah, no problem. We'll get that and add that to our list of crap we gotta do, Woodson. You know, because we haven't had a busy schedule or whatever. <sighs> Alright, I'm going to make a quick cut, and I will come back to you after I've done all my, whatever, selling and whatnot. Alright, so I'll see you in a minute. Oh, well? Or I could kill these worker bots. You guys want to watch me kill the worker bots? Raise your hand if you want me to kill the worker bots. You there, in the back. Yeah? Alright, we'll kill the worker bots then. Oh, and immediately into the fight. Oh, that's not good. That's not good. Oh, that's... Oh, this... No. No. Oh. Whew. I saw this guy getting in melee range, and I thought, oh, this is going to be bad times. 
Okay, let's see. Nah, we should be okay. Let's light this guy up like a Christmas tree. This should be good. There we go. Nice. Okay, now, where are the other ones? Is it just two? Is it really just two of them? That doesn't seem right. Okay, well, maybe it is just two. Okay, let's move over here. Actually, hold on. Just wanted to hit here. 100%, but I'm gonna hit my own guy. Interesting. Okay, swap back. Yeah, let's melt this guy. Peace out. Have a nice day. Worker bots! And... Suck Neutron Projector. Uh, let's go here. And hi. Oh, I can't. Oh. It's frustrating when this happens. Okay, let's switch to this single shot mode. So I can move. Oh, yeah. Hey, I got, I got, I got a present for you. It's called giant ass mace to the head. Yeah. Whoa. That's right. That's right. Okay, that was ridiculously easy, huh? Listen to me getting all overconfident. Probably shouldn't be doing that. That's that usually ends up being a bad idea. And no loot off these guys again, huh? Yeah, these cheap worker bot bastards. Alright. Let's head out. Now, barring any other in random encounters, I'll go back in here and uh, I'll be back with you in a second. Dear Mr. Manners, this is Ryan Friendly. I'm calling from the old school at Jefferson and Six. I hate to be rude and I hope you'll forgive the abruptness of this call. A loss of civility is to be expected under stress, gentle caller. Please, go... We've got some strange-looking creatures out here firing at us. They're humanoids, but I don't think they're human. We've got a pretty good barricade up, but if you could maybe see your way clear to sending over someone... Ah. Ouch! God damn it! Ow! Sorry about the swearing, sir. Apology accepted, gentle caller. You said the old school at Jefferson and Sixth? We'll have a team there quickly. Echo One, this is Santa Fe Base. Come in. Roger, Echo One. Don't know if you heard that Manta Rite call, but this could be our chance. We've got fake rangers attacking a school and the Manta Rites on their way. If we can show those prissy sons of bitches we're both fighting the same enemy, we might end this nightmare once and for all. Send in the coordinates. Okay. Um, Send for Echo One. Send a fake base. I, I kind of wanted to sell stuff, but uh, this is probably time sensitive. All right, let's go. What do we got? Children of the Citadel approaching your position? Yeah, attack. Guess there's going to be some combat in this episode. That seems to be the case. We got over here. Uh huh. Okay. Okay. Come on. Set up right here. This map's very awkward. Don't like this map at all. Not one bit. Okay. Chisel, come up here. Vulture. Yeah, I couldn't even see the set up properly. Whoa, alright.
I don't know. Stay up here and fight? No. Move back out of line of sight, I think, is the best bet. We have a firing possibility here. Sight blocked, sight blocked, sight blocked. Okay, then we're going to set ambush. Okay, maybe if I zoom all the way out. Yeah, that's how I'm going to have to do this. Okay, better. Okay, we're out of range here. Barely. Okay, let's move up to... Let's crouch and fire on him. Wow, that's a pretty long-ass throw that guy's got there, but... Little Green Goober can take it. He certainly can. Sight blocked. Okay. Fine. Move up. Crouch. Sit ambush. Uh huh. You know what? I think we're just gonna let them come up to us. Yeah. XCOM style. We're just gonna wait. Uh huh. Sit ambush. Sight blocked, huh? Yeah, they'll move forward, and then we'll be able to take shots. Okay, well, I'm gonna wait. Gonna wait. Let's see, do I have a shot with the sniper? No, because this is obscuring our view, evidently. Or apparently. Pick your word, it doesn't matter. Okay, we'll set ambush. Where do we want Vulture? You know what? She can go, like, right here, actually. That's fine. And crouch. In turn. Oh, he got lit up. And we'll finish him off. Mm, not quite, huh? Okay. Ah, going up top, huh? Okay, sneaky bastard. That's fine. We can do that too. Of course, he has the advantage of being up top. You know what? I think I'll just stay right there with Chisel for now. Oh, that's not good. Hmm, no sightline, huh? To anyone. Okay, well, we're gonna have to move. Okay, let's move here and crouch. Does she have sightlines now? Nope, well, not enough AP, but doesn't say she doesn't have sightline. Okay. Swap. There we go, and again. They kill him? Almost. He's bleeding, and he's only got five health, so... He will die eventually. Or we can make, for sh make it for sure right now. How about for sure right now? Yeah. Okay, end... Hmm, that was painful. I should probably switch weapons, actually. There we go. Okay, this is the bigger threat, so we'll go here. Mm-hmm. There we go. Single shot. There we go, nice. Okay, he's purple goo. 
And now let's finish dealing with these guys. Mm-hmm. There we go. Oh, I need to switch my trinkets back. But we're alright, we're alright. It's not a problem. Okay, good. Okay, no sight line. Okay, set ambush. And I'll set ambush here too. You can reload. There we go. Nice. Sight blocked, huh? about from here? Still blocked, huh? Alright. Let's move up. Oh no, this guy's done. Hi! Alright, well, we got hurt. Uh, you know, Chisel got hurt a little bit, but not too bad. It's an interesting fight. You guys got anything on him? Long barrel, okay. Luchador belt, plus two strength, minus two speed. That's interesting. Alright. Oh, another dowsing rod. Alright. Decoder rings, junk, sledgehammer. Leather jacket, some TNT. There's some guys over here that we can loot. Alright, let's go do that. Let's take a look at this while we're waiting. Sledgehammer. Does more damage, better armor penetration. Well, that looks like a no-brainer. Alright, well, we'll be switching to that then. Once it's modified. Suppressor, human foot... Grand Slam Weight. Minus 10% chance to hit, but plus 15% critical? Oh, wow. That's pretty impressive. I am so weighed down with stuff. Well, let's do a quick comparison on these G3s. They do less damage. They have slightly better armor pen, and they do lower AP. So they're good, they're not, I mean, not only that they're better, per se. You can burst with 8, which is, which is nice, actually. But it's a 3-shot burst. I, no, actually, they're not better. That's weird. Yeah, what's, I, I'm, what am I missing here? What, how is this better? Range? No. Arm pin is one better. Uh, yeah. Okay, well. We'll break some of these down. Okay. Actually, we'll break several of them down. Okay, now, let's grab this and this. Let's strip the mods off of here. Yep, and then let's grab... What was that other... Where's it at? Hold on. Yeah, Grand Slam weight. Let's grab that. Attach that here. Okay, plus 15% critical. And then let's go ahead and attach the leather grip. 4 AP. Wow, that thing is crazy. Look at that. Okay. Well, 
Ralphie 2.0, you're good to go now. And I don't really want to lug this heavy ass thing around, but I guess I will for now. Okay, he's overloaded. Pass that up there then. And overloaded again, okay. <laughs> Ah, uh, really needed to go back to base. Really needed to. Does anyone have any open space? Yes. Uh, she does, kind of. Okay. So we can just barely carry everything. Alright, let's call in. Copy, Ranger Team Echo 1. Congratulations, Echo 1. Okay, so... Oh, right, her attribute point. I need to spend that. Speed? Yeah. Combat initiative goes up. Action points go up. Okay. Speed it is. And skill points, four. Okay, she can't do anything meaningful with that, so... We'll just say commit points and wait for the next level. Alright, let's get out of here. Where's the exit? Where are you, exit? Over here. Okay. Oh, I probably should heal up Chisel, right? If we're going to go fight again. Yeah, not a terrible idea to do that. Come on. There we go, and again. Nice. Okay. And this is with small small health packs. So her healing ability is pretty solid. Okay, let's heal Mal up a little bit. I am going to need to buy some more medical supplies here at some point. But the ones I'm carrying actually are beefier, the other ones that I have. They heal a lot more, so I, I don't know, I, I'm probably okay. Come on, let's go. Move it! Uh, Dugan's worker bot's approaching your position. Okay, let's go. Or Dungans, however you want to say it. Okay, let's zoom out. Where are they? Over here, okay. And are these the guys that are just melee? I can't tell. All right, well, let's set up. We've got decent positioning this time. Actually. Is everyone's weapons reloaded? Yeah, looks like it. Okay. Put her... Come on, over here. Yep. Anton can go over here. Bruno can go here. Christy can hang out up here. Mal over here behind cover. Vulture can hang out like right here. Okay, all right, we're good. We're mostly set up. I was just gonna move Chisel up. That was the last thing. Oh, hello, Mr. Workerbot. And um, goodbye, Mr. Workerbot. Okay, here. We have three more targets here. 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 Okay, they're all over this area. Okay. There we 
go. Eh, this shouldn't be a problem. Nah, we're good. One of them gets too close, then we'll uh, hit him with that gun that lassos him up. Okay, armor seven. Okay, neutron projector it is. Okay, in turn. Yeah, there's one that's gonna come over from that side. That's fine. Shouldn't be a problem. There we go. Ah, oh, I still need to swap my trinket. Damn it. <laughs> All right, shoot him. There we go. Where's the last one at? Where are you? Oh, there you are. Coming around, sneaky bastard. Sight blocked. Okay. How about from here? Still blocked? No. Okay, neutron projector. Meat worker bot. Is that it? It is. Alright, and before I forget again, let's swap our trinket out. Two more promotions, huh? Okay, let's call those Captain in. Ranger Team Echo. Echo one. Congratulations, Echo one. Three skill points. Yep, can't really do anything with that. And who else got promoted? Chisel got promoted. Okay. Um. Five skill points. Nope. Okay, we'll hold on to those. Okay, swap weapons. Everybody's good? Hold on, let's check here. Nah, yeah, reload. Okay, well, we're definitely getting good experience from these fights, I'll give it that. Alright, let's get out of here. Baldwin Hills, huh? Okay, here we go. Yeah, more people framing us, huh? Alright, let's go. I don't have time to fart around. Okay, how about... Uh, I melt you. That's a possibility, right? I don't know if that was smart or not. Actually, probably wasn't smart. <laughs> but I did it anyway. There we go. Nice. Oh, okay. We're alright, we're alright. Okay, let's get to some cover points here, shall we? Yeah, I think that makes sense. Now, who's the biggest threat? Pulse Gunner. Melee guy's gonna have to run around. Not worry about him. Pulse Gunner. Any more lobbers? No. Alright, then let's light this guy up like a Christmas tree. Nope, not enough AP. Alright. There we go. Very nice. How much left? 138. Okay, not a problem. Put her up to cover. No. We can just outrange. Yep, we'll outrange. She should be safe back there. Whoa, okay, that, okay. You guys are getting a little too close there. 
Don't like that too much. Like so. Pulse gunner, huh? Whoa. Okay. Okay, I need your help out here, Chisel. I need you to Mac... Really just, like, hit this guy like a Mack truck, man. Uh, that was not what I was looking for, bro. Not what I was looking for from you. Go to cover or fire? Or pull back? Or go here? That's not bad. Yeah, Mal needs to be able to stay in the fight for sure, so... Well, in theory, I have cover over here. I, I don't know. I'm not sure. Okay, let's finish this guy off. That's cover? Really? The fire hydrant? But no shot if I go. Or a shot, but no burst. Probably worth it. We can still take this guy out. Uh, okay. I thought I could take that guy out. I'm not using her shot on that. Uh-uh. 42%. Is that it? Really? Okay, let's see if we can melt this guy. There we go. Nice. And crouch. Who's getting hit? Did Chisel get hit? I, looks like I'm okay. Work on this guy? Yeah. Or... Mm, hold on. Let me think a second. Yeah. Smaller burst at this guy. There we go. Bigger burst at this guy. Alright. Chisel's okay. He can take it. Okay, let's go for this shot. Okay, back up again. We finish this guy? Not if we miss. Okay, we're alright. Still okay. How you doing? Yeah, peace out. Have a Coke and a smile. There we go. Nice. Okay. Hmm. When who who attacks next? This guy does? But Chisel's gonna get to go before that. Right? Yeah. Chisel's gonna go before either of these guys. This guy's only got 55 hit points. Yeah. Alright. We're shooting downfield then. Oh, I didn't mean to hit that guy, but I, I guess that worked out. Okay, now. We're gonna move right here. And... Uh-huh. Line's right on him. It's only gonna hit the one, I think. Yeah. Alright, let's do it anyway. There we go. How you doing? How about shot to the head? You like that? Yeah, me too. Okay, and let's move her to cover. Yeah, that's not gonna save you, pal. And that's your ass. 
All right, we got a little, we got a little beat up. But all in all, I think that went pretty well. So I'll deal with all this inventory stuff, and we'll talk to these folks uh, at the beginning of the next one, because this video's gotten pretty darn long. So uh, I hope you enjoyed it, and if you did, please hit that thumbs up button. As always, I appreciate your comments and feedback. Thanks so much for watching, and until next time, I'm Mal, and I will see you later. Oh, quick FYI, don't forget that I am running another Wasteland 2 giveaway. Uh, the details are in the uh, blog, my uh, monthly update video. So if you check that, all the information about it will be in there. So make sure you check it out. All right? Thanks, folks. Bye.